I want to, you know, I, I just want to emphasize something you said I think is great is, you know, number one, it's the critical infrastructure, it's the emergency communications, but I think you did a really good job there of just summarizing that amateur radio is important for technological advancement and for regular citizens be able to train in the radio art and science as well and maintain that technological supremacy. So that's really, really an incredible and important point as well. I'm curious, John, do you have an idea of, do, I mean, I, I don't know if there's even a way to get good numbers on this, but just the number of uh, hams today that are in an HOA, you gave us, you did give us a little bit of the, you know, the, most of these communities, I think you said 80% are, are implementing this type of restriction. Do we know, you know, just how big of a problem it is today for amateur radio? And it seems like it's growing as well. Let me change your numbers a little bit. It's not 80% of the subdivisions are doing this. 100% of them are. It's 80% of all new housing developments have the restrictions. 100% of them have the restrictions. Have this. There's no place to go. 